everyone and welcome back. So, I wonder, is this the first time you've seen me today or is this several uh, videos down the list? You're quite right, this is not my only video today. I decided that today, because I want to reward you guys for being here for me, for helping this channel grow more than I actually thought possible at first because I, I wasn't that confident and helping me try and get to that 1,000 uh, subscribers, 4,000 watch time hours before summer. I'm going to keep giving you as much content as I can and giving you what you want to see, hopefully. So I'm doing several videos today. This is one of many. They all react to different things in geography and quizzes, um, me interacting with it, maybe giving it a go as well, maybe playing along if I think I can. So um, yeah, have a watch. Hope you enjoy them. Let me know. Is this video one for you? Is this video two, three? Where, where are we in the list? Are you only going to watch one of them? Are you watching several? Let me know in the comments below. Let's get on with the video. Okay, so we are back with Jack playing Wordle for countries. Whatever this is. Basically, I'm playing every geography themed Wordle that I can find, and I'm about 18 months late. Okay. He's about 18 months late for Wordle in general, but um, I've played one of these. I've played Word World. This is, I think. The one that I've played. I don't think I've played any others, but he's now going to show us all of them, so maybe I have. But I remember Worldle because I remember when he played these before. Um, let's see if we can play along, maybe. Worldle, a very easy one to begin with. This is obviously India. Guess. Whoa! Uh, look at that. We yeah. got confetti and everything. That's nice. Plus, I mean, Worldle it just looks like India. Bonus rounds, which is quite nice, so we can guess the neighbouring countries. Okay, so that is new. The last time I last time I played Worldle, um, and I actually I played another one that was kind of things in there. But um, last time I did that, there was no such thing as bonus rounds. So I'm hoping maybe this is oh guess neighbours. Okay, there's four neighbours before he goes into them. Four neighbours. Okay, so ah uh, Pakistan obviously, Pakistan, uh, Bangladesh, ah. Uh, Afghanistan or is Afghanistan just bordering Pakistan? Afghanistan's definitely around there, or does it just border Pakistan? Or does it not border either? I want to say in uh, Bangladesh, Pakistan, Afghanistan. How are we? Uh, what are we saying by borders? Because obviously there's Sri Lanka, but that's that doesn't border it because there's a there's there's water in between. But those are my four. I'm gonna I'm gonna let's see if it counts it as as bordering it. Few, but I reckon I should be able to get most of them. Oh, there's eight. Oh shit! Right. Okay. Wait a minute. Wait. 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 Okay. So those are those are what they look like. I'm trying to do it before. Um, I'm trying to play along. Ish. There's eight. I thought there was only four. I thought it said four. Get fucking. Ah. Okay. Oh my god. What else is there? I mean, India. It's it's huge. So it borders so many other countries. What is there? What is there? Just. Ah. No. Help me out, Jack. Well, let's go for that one. Yep. And then that's Pakistan. Right, okay. So there's my point. <laughs> Straight off. Sri Lanka. Am I being really dumb? Sri Lanka's an island. It doesn't border Sri Lanka. Or are we because it's or am I only thinking because it doesn't say land border that we're going well in the same way that England borders France, even though it's not attached? I mean, okay, I said Sri Lanka. There we go. And Pakistan, I said that. Also got, oh, yeah, I can get these. Come I can on. get all of these. Be on sure on one and two. Number three is definitely China. There you go. Oh, my and God. Is, uh, Myanmar, number four. Myanmar, I missed four. China. This is going well. Myanmar. <clears throat> so, any of you that don't know, I have a, a master's degree in political theory and practice of resistance. One of my main things was um i did a university project with others um as a document a un style document on the conditions in myanmar and had to talk about the way it relates to its neighbors including india and i still didn't know okay i try not to stop that many times guys but you know nepal of course nepal that's why the gurkhas fight for england because we went through oh my god this is painful. This is painful, guys. This is painful. Bangladesh is definitely. Yeah, Bangladesh. Okay, I knew that. Afghanistan's definitely there, I'm sure. Unless it only borders Pakistan. When there's no sense of scale, that's what throws me off. I'm going to just try some ones that are nearby. I'm going to try Afghanistan and guess. Yes! Come on! I actually only thought it was Pakistan, but maybe not. What is the last one? 
What is that? Might forgive up, you know, which is really what sad, is that? Because I'll definitely just be kicking myself. But yeah, let's give up. What was it? It was Bhutan. Okay, I was so I'm so on that list. Bangladesh, I got. Uh, Pakistan, I got. Afghanistan, I got. Sri Lanka, I got. But yeah, Bhutan wouldn't have even thought about. China, I'm annoyed I didn't get. Nepal is so obvious. I used to live near Gurkhas, who are from Nepal, and the whole history and, and anecdotal background of them is that England went had just gone through India, then got to Nepal, and I didn't know that one. And my own my, as I say, I did that at a project at the university. So, um, yeah, yeah. My trivia knowledge, uh, not living up to much today. Okay, guess the capital. Okay. Well, so that's Myanmar, that's China, uh, Bhutan, that uh, Bhutan, uh, bottom Bhutan, right Bhutan, one in. Well, that's India, and that's yeah. So, <laughs> so I was trying to how. <laughs> yeah, that's a. So I did a project, uh, and also, also, when I was at primary school, I had a project on in India. I don't know if anyone remembers doing these at primary school, but you have like a project, and everything, all your learning is around the project. Mine was on India. I'm genuinely annoyed, guys. I don't know. <laughs> I'm, mate, hey, everyone's like, can you can you shut the fuck up and let Jack speak? We, we want to watch Jack, not just you screaming. But I'm what the? the estimated population, uh, it's over a billion. It's now officially the most populated. It's one point three now. Oh, one point nearly one point four. Okay, Rupert, that's easy. Okay. I've played this one. This is the other one I have played. Actually, Spin quite cool this game. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay, where are we going? Uh, I'm gonna close my eyes. I'm gonna shake it about, and then whatever my mouth. Is I I I'm tend to oh, fuck up on this one when we get into Africa. I'm not gonna lie. Which isn't an acceptable answer. Okay, we'll do it again. Click, click, click. Because I'm really bad at the are. order of where countries. Yeah, it's like Thailand, I think. I'll try Thailand then. Okay, so the country is okay. 9,600 kilometers from Thailand. So basically, I need to be more over here. So that alone messes me up. I'm from the UK. I don't do kilometers. <laughs> so I'll be like, how many miles? So Burkina Faso is our second guess. Oh my god, Ooh. it borders it's Burkina next Faso. to Burkina Faso. That's a load of countries. Be Ghana, I think. Maybe Liberia. Which should I try? I'll go See, Liberia. this is where Jack has a massive advantage over someone like myself. Because I'm, I, uh, I'm good at knowing, like, the countries that are in Africa. I can probably name most of them. Don't know where they are. Like, I'm, I'm quite bad at knowing... Like, I know generally where they are. I know Algeria, you know... There, South Africa, Eswatini. I know, like, I know where-ish, but... No, no, no. I wouldn't have been able to tell you that was Mali. I'm quite bad at that. Maybe this is a GeoGuessr issue. Okay, next we're going to do hmm. country, but first, please subscribe if you haven't already. I would really appreciate it. I only need like 20,000 subscribers. And I'm going to leave that in. I am subscribed to all of Jack's channels with all of mine. It's quite good. It gives you a bunch of data. Let's start with Cyprus because it's in my head now. There you go. So now it compares the data on Cyprus to okay. whatever the correct answer so it's is. it's not north. Because this is red, that means not that northern the Europe. that we're looking for is not in the northern hemisphere. It's in the yeah. southern. It's also not in Europe. Its average temperature is close to 19 degrees. It's I above it. it There's an arrow it's upwards. Singular. It also has less than 1.2 million people. And it's south Um, No, Jack. Cyprus. That's an arrow upwards. There's more. Cyprus that doesn't have that many people. There's more. One point two million is not much. I wonder if I should try the Maldives. It's more. Am I? Am I being dim? It's more, right? More. And see what we get. Oh, yeah. yeah, there's an arrow again. It's more. Guess, but at least we know that the population. Wait, no, no, no. I'm misunderstanding. Whatever. The realization on his face. Country this is has more Love than it. Two million people, not less. I got the okay. Uh. In that case, I oh God knows. I'm for countries around there. I'm not great at knowing their populations. I would have got known. Fair play. Fair play. I would not have known that. Which landmark is in South Africa? Ooh, that uh, look, uh, well, maybe that's bottom good. right, isn't that this Cape? Um, oh, uh, yeah, it's bottom right, right? I'm gonna say this one though, and it's just a 
of a guess. Oh, I was wrong. Well, I'll try this one then. Nice one. You correctly guessed Cape of Good Hope. Cape of Good Hope. I knew there. There's, there's a load of capes in South Africa. Round. Where in South Africa was the portal of Cape oh, of Good Hope? Oh, God. Right. Well, obviously, we know it's on a coast, so it's not this one. This is maybe the right shape in this area, but I And that is Lesotho and Eswatini. That's just cheating. This one, because that's a landlocked area. That's Eswatini here, and then it moves straight on to Uh, oh, God. I don't know. This one, I, I just knew that I'd seen that image before, so I knew it was one of the, the capey bits, but no idea where. Another bonus round. Oh my god. Which city in South Africa was this photo taken in? Oh my good god. I'm gonna screw up. The only one I can think of is Cape Town, so let's try it. Guess. <gasps> <laughs> How did I not know that? I'm a globe trotter. Cape Town's a really obvious part of fuck about. I need I need some travel again, guys. I need I need to go away again. Shall I Shall I just go to Cape Town? Shall I do what um <laughs> I do what Rainbow does and just fuck it, just live abroad for a year, just randomly go to countries. Uh. He's a nice little turtle and he's got glasses like me. That's nice. <laughs> All right, I guess we move on to capital. Things are going I prefer his well. glasses actually, Jack. Uh, <laughs> Is Cape Town an acceptable answer? Yeah, let's go for it. Ooh. Although, saying that, <laughs> Jack, your glasses beat mine, my friend. When I put these on, I look like a substitute teacher. Yes, I'm too vain to wear them on camera. Shut up. Ooh, okay. <laughs> in Africa, but everything else is wrong, and it's northwest of Cape Town. So now we know where Cape Town is. Basically, it has to be over in Western Africa, doesn't it? Oh my God! Can I name any capitals in Western Africa? No, I don't think <laughs> I can. I've not learned them yet. Oh God! Nigeria. I used to think that their capital was Lagos, but it isn't. Lagos is just the most populated place in Nigeria. Oh, what am I gonna do? Right. What oh, I need the capital. Type the country. They very help. Oh, what? what the capital is. So That's I'm not going to accept it as a real point because I'm kind of cheating, aren't I? Let's be honest. But we yeah. need to move on. So Nigeria. I don't well, given that, <laughs> given that at some point Jack has to learn all the capitals of the world. Good luck with that one, buddy. <laughs> could be a very hard answer, but we'll try it. Ooh, still northwest of Guinea. Not Conakry far, in Guinea. Okay. So I'm going to try and learn these. Mali? We'll go with Bamako. Just going to put this one out there. Um, South. So. The top one for South Africa. South Africa has three or, or is it four capital cities? Can you name them, by the way? Anyone down below, can you name all of them? I won't I won't say. There's one of them that I always muck up on. Okay, so there's one. You'll get two of them, definitely. One of them always messes people up. Um, can you name them? Because that's that's a kind of a tricky question. Although, yes, the other stuff, stuff is red. But this could theoretically go green, 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 green. It could say kind of green all the way along and still be wrong. Because South Africa doesn't just have one capital city. It has three I think it's the only... Is there another country that does that? Let me know. Is there another country? Because I can't think of one. In Mali. Let's try that. No, but this time now it's just west. I'll try Dakar in Senegal. No, now I've gone too high. Now I need to go south. Dakar. The only reason I know Dakar is the Dakar rally. Less than 1.1 million people. Should I go with Guinea-Bissau? Could be a small place. And the capital of Guinea-Bissau is Bissau. That's nice. Oh, we got it. Had to be somewhere small. Once you know the population, at least you can go for that. This is... Oh, all right, guys, I was actually looking at the map. There we go. So, yeah, you can see that my first guess was Cape Town, which is down here. And when they said it was southwest, I knew that we'd have to be anywhere around this area. All right, now we move on to Blind Secret Country, which is a what? sparkle game. And I think it works the same as Global with the colours, but it's oh. a flat MacArthur projection world map rather than a cute little spinny globe. And it's timed too, so... One minute 30. Now. That's not I long. I, I actually know the answer to this. Oh, wait, what? Because obviously I needed to work out how the game works. So let me... Okay. That is a lot more difficult. When he said it was a flat map, I thought it'd be like, oh, just a flat map. But it looks like you say it and it appears. Oh, I'm not good at finding things on a map. Well, I, I can. I'm, you know, I know where the... I, you know, I know where things are. And I know the continents. But, like, telling you exactly where Mali is, for instance. Fuck. Let me explain. So if I say UK, it's all yellow because I'm not that close. That's difficult. If I was to say South Africa, it's orange because... It's a bit closer, so that means it's probably somewhere, somewhere around in between. here. So of course, it is the Democratic Republic of Congo. Okay, now let's do one that I've not already played. Let's try. I was just saying, how the fuck did you get that so quick? Is because he he'd already done it. Ooh, oh, okay. Brazil, so probably got the right continent. Maybe Argentina. 
So let's go Chile. Peru. Oh, same distance. Argentina, maybe? Oh, same distance. That means it's probably in the middle of those. Bolivia. Yes, there we go. Okay, I'm saying UK again because it's going well for me. Right. Let's try Japan this time. Bit closer. Near Japan. Maybe India? No, actually. Probably. South Korea? New Zealand? No, New Zealand. Way too far away. Right, let's get Russia visible. Oh. Ooh. Okay, so neighbors Russia there. China? So North, North Korea? Korea, could it be? Let's try it. No. South Korea, anyone? No. Right, I'm in the wrong China? area then. So I need to be maybe Kazakhstan. Georgia? Kazakhstan. Oh, no, it's not orange. That's so for worse. That means it must be around China. Is there China? No. Is it Mongolia? Oh. It was. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you start to forget where the hell you are. That's a really diff. This one's a really difficult one. South Africa then. Like you start filling in the things and remembering what the countries are. Guess maybe it's North America rather than South. Let's try. So Canada. Ooh, here we go. Oh, don't tell me it's Central American. Uh, Nicaragua. Uh, oh God. I think that means it neighbors it. Costa Rica then? No. Belize? <laughs> no. I can't think. Uh, of it. I'll try Cuba no. while I'm here. And yeah. Haiti as well. Similar distance for all of those. Panama. Guatemala, then go on. No. Dominica. No. How the fuck is he guessing? Guatemala then. Guatemala. Our minds are combining. He's guessing the same as me. I'm I'm out. I just getting obscure for number four. Yeah, I was like I was running out of countries. This is the only ones I could think of. Oh, this could be our first European one. Poland, maybe. What the <laughs> fuck? So like where? Canada, then. I don't know. Well, I guess we have to go back to North Korea. That's a shame. We got it. Fucking oh, hell. Get me I love that just a random guess is, and get no some. No, so let's go Argentina. Could be, could be. Maybe Colombia in that case. By the way, random thought. Um, Let me know if you like uh, the colour, because we can change it, of course. So if you want to see a different colour in the background, let me know. I like blue. We've always been blue when we're doing this, but let me know if you want another one. Let's keep going. Oh, here we go. Right, let's try Suriname. Oh, we are flying. Next one. Damn. I, should I try this? Let me know. Should I try this game? Because this this is a game I think I can kind of get, but at the same time, be really fucked over on. Should I go on and do the sporkle geography stuff? Is that something Is that something you guys would like to see? Jordan, Syria, Israel. Yes. And now the final quiz of the video. UK off the bat. Ireland then? Ireland then? No, could it be Spain then? Let's try Spain. No, further away. Um, yes, trying to catch me out with a little island far away from all the stuff. Not a problem for me. Thank you very much for watching. This was really fun, actually. I wish I'd made this a year. Okay, so another fun one there from Jack. Um, <laughs> I think I'm starting to sound like Jack because I watch so much of his content. Um, but uh, yeah, that one came out. Uh, I don't know when they came out. I just saw it because I've been. Because I've been doing this for you to do all these videos. Um, but yeah, that one was fun. But Jesus. Do you want to see me do any of these games? Um, these are kind of in between. Because obviously some of the trivia stuff I know I can do better on that. I've been doing it with the GeoGuessr um, quiz and things like that. But I'm still being, being caught out when it's a bit more specific. So let me know. Would you like to see it? And also let me know if you're seeing this, if you're watching the other ones, what number is this for you? Is this the first one you've watched? Is this the only one you're watching? Is this number two, three? Where are we? And um, hey, if you're not here again till Wednesday, I'll see you with my GeoGuessr attempt. See you then.